Hey, God stays on schizophrenia and sees the day. Schizophrenia sees the day, but before we seize the day, please allow my brief prelude. As you know, I've conveniently recorded it for our mutual comfort, our mutual convenience, and our mutual luxury. And hey, listen, I'm no spring chicken. And I've had around a few preludes in my ears. I'm telling you, this kid, this prelude, it's got something that's particularly luxurious. Kind of like gay. Kind of like a. Uh, you got something today? I'm I'm fresh out under the sun, luxurious items. You got something? You do? An acorn? Yeah. Hello there, my name is agree. Robert Francis. You've stumbled on my unconquering schizophrenia YouTube channel. Where me and the bird. That's right, that's right. We talk schizophrenia. That's right. This is the cut of my jib right the here. For ever of my medical confidentiality. Luxurious acorn. I'm a licensed clinical social worker times 15 years. That's a lot of gabbing and chatting. I've been diagnosed with schizophrenia for a score five and one. And that puts a little gray fleck in my beard. Mike the acorn. Thank you for joining me on my channel. Now to topic, to topic, to topic. To topic, to topic. You know, I don't know much. Um, the whole concept of time uh, really uh, befuddles me oftentimes. I, I can't really... I wish I could understand the dimension of time better, and I'm working on it. But time is a very interesting dimension. It can, uh, it can buoy, buoy, hold us up, or it can deflate us time oftentimes, I think. So, with schizophrenia or otherwise, it's best to try to stay in the moment sometimes and just enjoy the day the best you can. Focus on one day at a time and not always your past or your future. That time dimension is, uh, is a really interesting um, dimension to me. Seize the day just means that you try to do something pr productive over the course of your day. Um, maybe something, you know, uh, accomplish certain items that you want to. Try not to lament about the past or prognosticate about the future so much. It's about time, time. Staying in the moment. Gladwell wrote that book. What was that? The, uh, the Power of Now? I, I think that was Toll, actually. Eckhart Toll, The Power of Now. And uh, it's about uh, trying to live in the moment. But it's uh, schizophrenia or otherwise can deplete us. It can very much deplete us and cause us to be uh, downtrodden. But let that not be the case. Try to seize the day. Try to have a capacity for, for joy or for friendship or for happiness just sometime over the course of the day. Do not throw, overgeneralize and throw the entire day out the window. The baby with the bathwater. Try to seize the day in the sense that your day was okay. At the end of the day, you had an okay day. For me, that's seize the day. Carpe diem, carpe diem. Uh, Dead Poet Society, uh, a great movie, and that was a theme, carpe diem. The acorn, it's good nibbles for the squirrels, I believe. I think they, they store them up and eat them. Can human beings eat acorns? I don't know. What's the deal with an acorn? Does it have protein in it or something? Why do the squirrels eat the acorns? They store them and then they eat them. I don't know. All right, guys. Salvage the day. That's what it should have been called. Not seize the day. Salvage the day. And we'll see you next time. Thanks.